It sounded like, honestly, it sounded like something ran up the stairs. But yeah, that's the first image of that guy. What was that? Yes, yes I, I did. did. I heard yes, that. I did. All right, guys. Here we go. All right, guys, welcome back. We are here still at Norwich State Hospital. We have moved across the street now. We are over in the nurses' dorm building. Last week, we investigated Lippitt, which was the psychopathic hospital of the property. Um, this building itself is just as dark, just as scary, um, just as abandoned. So this one actually makes me feel more uncomfortable than Lippitt most of the time. So I'm not looking forward to getting in here, not looking forward to doing solos, but yeah. You know, why not? We're already here. Last time we were here, you were actually rushed at. Um, we heard some music, we thought it was people breaking in, so we went up to the roof, there's roof access in this building, and uh, we noticed that it was coming from the other building over here. Turns out no one was on the property, it was just phantom music. You could hear singing. Yep, and you went down the stairs, or the, the ladder that was up there, and it sounded like someone ran up behind you. Yeah, it was one of the freakiest things that's happened to me in a long time. I mean, I was I was shaken up. I like yeah. floated up the stairs there for a second. Um, it really caught me off guard. There was nobody in the building, so that was strange. So again, can't wait to get inside here it's gonna be so um, cool. and do some solos. We're gonna jump right in. Uh, we're gonna move one floor at a time. We're gonna start on the first floor, go second and third, and then we're gonna break up and do solos on the two floors that are the most active, uh, whatever that ends up being tonight. And uh, we'll just kind of see where it goes from there. Yeah, let's do it. Let's go. All right, guys, we're on the first floor of the nurses' building here. We pretty much set up all the equipment that we have. We're just trying to see what exactly they want to interact with, where they want to draw us. We have Melmeter over here to my left, your right. We have the uh, rope light set up leading towards the music box. Um, again, we have pretty much everything set up. If we need to, we can break out the DR60s, do some EVPs. Yeah. But we're going to go floor by floor, see what we can run into here. A lot of stuff in here is audible. Like, we hear yeah. footsteps, um, stuff moving, voices. So that's something we want to keep an eye out for and kind of, you know, really listen, see if we can hear anything. Yeah. Um, but again, guys, this building is even darker than Lippet. Take a look at this. Yeah, it's dark. Little so, ambient light from the uh, rope light. That's it. That's it. All right. And again, guys, we have permission to be here. Don't break in. Don't do it, especially while we're here. Please yeah, don't. That'd be rude. Be scary. We're just going to kind of listen and see if we can get him to interact with anything. Mm -hmm. Hello? Are there any nurses here? Patients? Doctors? My name is Dylan. Did you hear that? No, did you hear? Sound like a female voice. Sounded distant though. Like down the hallway or upstairs? Upstairs. I couldn't tell what it said, it was faint. Like he was saying, this is Dylan, I'm Steve. We're just here to talk to you. We want to learn what it was like to live here, work here. Could you make a noise for us if you can hear our voices? What was that? What was that? What was that? Was that like a door? I don't know what that was. Thank you so much. What is that? I don't know. Hashtag surrounded. Oh! What is happening? <laughs> literally both sides. Guys, you can literally see that staircase down there. The windows are boarded up. All the doors are boarded up. There's no physical way someone could be down there right now. Uncomfy. Immediately. Can you yes. step away from that? 
What was that noise, I though? Know, there was two of them. It was so loud. Can you step away from that, please, so it stops? What are the odds that all of that goes off at the same time as we hear those noises? Yeah. We hear those noises, music box, rope light. Very, very slim chance. Can you... Was that like a... It was down there. Can you step away from that for a second so it stops, please? We're gonna have to turn that off. Yeah. Because I want to hear. That was so loud. Solar's gonna suck in this building. Yup. What is that? Did you hear that? Yeah, what is that? Like a woman moaning? Yeah. That echoed. Hello? This is why I hate this building. Like Lippet, we had like a good five minutes where we could kind of warm up to yeah. it. This is literally thrown into the deep end. Those noises were so loud. And then the music box and then the room. And then the woman's voice. Are you working? Are you working? Are you working? What is going on? What was that? Was it like the door at the end of the hallway? I don't know. Because I heard it like reverberate, yeah. You know? What was that? Why are we always surrounded? Can you slam a door for us? I said shit. Oh. <laughs> what is happening? Do we need to check if somebody's breaking it? That's what I mean. That's what's so terrifying about this location. Again, like we said last video, not only do we have ghosts to worry about, but living people and animals breaking in. Very homestead-esque. Except again, yeah, the homestead, we know the ways in and out. Yeah, and there's like 1,500 exits right. in each of these buildings. Right. Or entrances, if you see it that way. Right. But if it was a person, we would have heard music, we would have heard the car pull up. Hello? 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 Can you make a noise for us? Knock on the door. Say something? Can you set off one of these devices we have set up? I have one over by the staircase that we just walked up. If you touch the top of it, walk near it. What was that? Walk near it. Walk near it. What was that? Same sort of noise though. If that was you coming up the stairs, can you set off that device? Can you knock for us like this? Like a 
off that. Yeah. Those were loud thuds. Bangs we asked for and make a noise and it did twice and then the rope went off and the music box. Yeah. And then that down there literally sounded like one of those doors moving. Yeah. This building sucks. Guys, one of the first things that we do when we film in locations like this, we walk the entire floor to make sure no one else is in here with us. We don't want to be... That's a safety thing. Yeah, that's a safety thing. Did you like working here? We know they trained you on the bottomies. Can you make a noise for us? wherever you are in the building. Open another door, close the door. Walk around. Set off a device. Whatever's easier for you. Turned out that was like a footstep or? Sad thing is, too, a lot of the people who would come here to work, they had really good intentions. They yeah. wanted to do the best for the patients, yeah. but lack of funding, lack of understaffed. Another voice. Oh. Another voice. Oh. Another voice. Oh. No, that sounds like you're in the building. That it was like the it was on the staircase. That was in the building. Yeah, that was in the building for sure. I don't know if that was going upstairs. I don't know. Hello? Uh, yeah, my phone? Yeah. Let's load it up. That literally sounded like it was right over here. Yeah. It sounded like, honestly, it sounded like something ran up the stairs. But yeah, that's the first image that I got. Something running up these stairs. There's a lot going on. I think that means we have to go upstairs. Hmm. Let's move up to the next floor. We'll do some spirit box sessions. Yeah. Um, maybe some EVPs. And then... Uh, Try to make contact with whatever that was. We'll see who just ran up the stairs. Yeah, let's do it. Let's go. All right, guys, so we came up to the next floor. We followed up whatever just ran up the stairs. That was some of the loudest footsteps I've heard in a very, very long time. It literally sounds like we just ran up the stairs and then talking. Yeah. Um, so we're up here on the second floor. It looks very similar to the first floor. This whole building kind of looks identical as we move up, but I hope whatever ran up here wanted us to follow it and yeah. not for a bad thing. I don't know. Um, but we're going to do the spirit box, but we're going to do it right out loud. We're not going to do it in a session. We're just going to let it play and see if we can catch anything like that. Um, and then we're going to try an experiment after we play some sounds 
from like an active hospital, something that they would have been used to here, um, at least not necessarily in this building, but maybe when they worked in the other buildings, um, hearing it. And they did do training and stuff in here, so who knows what kind of stuff went on. Um, so we'll see if that stirs up anything. We'll do some DR60 recordings of that as well. But we're going to start with probably five, ten minutes of just the spirit box and, and listening to see if we can catch anything like that. We do experiments all the time like this at events. If you want to join us on a ghost hunt, hauntednightsevents.com. Check it out. All right, join let's us. do it. Ready? Yep. Hello? Can you say hi? If you come down here and speak to us, we should be able to hear you. Just got to speak up. What? Yeah. It's, it's, it's so tough because, like, there was another thud. Yeah. Can you say one of our names if you recognize us? I can talk that anyway. Can you speak up a little bit for us? We understand it's probably difficult. It takes a lot of energy. We're going to stay here and talk to you. There's a lot of voices coming out here. Did you follow us from the Lippet building? Did you work here? What? That was a guy's voice. Yeah. Can you see us? What? That was a woman's voice. That was a hundred percent of a woman's voice. It was like, tell us something. Yeah, tell us something. It was like, tell us, tell us something. I tell us, like, tell us something. Quick. Yeah. Yeah. This place isn't in operation anymore. You don't have to be here. Do you feel stuck here? Two? 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 Or two? two? There's two of us, yep. How many of you are here? This one said two. Are there two of you? Did you ever work in this building or live here? Or are you from somewhere else? Does it upset you to see the building in this condition? Can you tell us who ran up the stairs? Do you not like people being here? It's just got that feeling. Yeah, that's it, weird. It feels awful. It feels like darkness is like... Yeah. That was a female voice again. Female voice again, yeah. It feels just uncomfortable up here, like... 
like we're not supposed to be up here. Yeah. Like we're unwanted, right. um, or we're in an area that we're not supposed to be in. What? Can you try to speak up a little bit for us so we can understand you? No, it was my voice. It was like not gonna or something like that. Yeah. Do you want us to leave? Are you sick and tired of people coming in here? Trashing? Yep. Yeah, you never like, yup. It was a deep man's yeah. voice. Yup. You sick and tired of people coming in here? Bothering you? Trashing the building? Sound like the same voice again, though. Yeah. Say out? Yeah, out. You want us out? Go away? There's a one's voice. Like, go away! Yeah. We're trying to tell your story. Recount the history of this place. Why do you want us to leave? We're gonna turn this off in a minute and try something else. Is that okay? Hey. Okay. Okay. Well, like, hey. Okay. Yeah. Just so we know that you can hear us and that you're willing to talk to us. Can you say the word apple? Can you say apple so we know you can hear us? What was that? It was like a hum. Yeah. I heard that. Turn that on. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep. That echo, again, it yeah. echoed down the hallway. Yeah. Dude, these noises in here. The voices, the, the footsteps. Voices. Those bangs we were hearing downstairs. Again, this is by far, like this campus in general is one of the freakiest places that I've ever been. It's one of, it's just, it never feels good anywhere. I mean, it's comparable to Indiana State Sanitorium as right. we referenced in the previous video, but like. It's got its, its own it's different, different vibe. Yeah. And it's not, obviously it has a very dark, a very sad history, mm -hmm. but sort of a lot of the places that we go yeah. and they don't feel like this. This place feels off. It just feels weird everywhere we go. Yeah. I don't like coming here. And it's wild thinking that a lot of the history is unknown. Yeah. They're still trying to piece it together because right. so many things were lost and or destroyed or... I mean, even the lobotomy room, they yeah. tried to cover it up. Yeah. You know? I don't know. This is not one of my favorite places to go. No. It is because it's active. And right. it's, it's incredible, the stuff that we get. I mean, those footsteps, those voices we've been hearing, all that kind of stuff is, is obviously why we do this. But like... Right. It doesn't feel good in these places. It no. doesn't feel like a comfortable place to come and try to research or make contact with them. It's not, it's not comforting at all. Between the two of us, we have 20 years of ghost hunting. Yeah, over 20 years. Over 20 years. But this place, it's like anxiety instantly. Yeah, the entire time you're here. Yeah. Let's do, uh, try playing that sound. Yeah, I'm gonna play some hospital sounds um, if I have service. I can always pull it out too. Let's see. That's why we don't have any of the EMF equipment out right now because I took my phone off airplane mode. Yeah. And we're going to play some, uh, some hospital sounds here. Let's see. All right, so we're going to play some regular hospital sounds and we're going to play some like flat line sounds. Yeah. That was down here. What was that? That was to the right. What was that? Hello? Sound like a voice. Mm -hmm. We're just hearing people talking. No, I mean, there's just voices. There's voices everywhere right now. It's full conversation. Voices, footsteps. All right, let's play some hospital sounds. This is gonna be so fun. Mm -mm. <laughs> All right, let's start with this one. See what we get going on here. 
All right, it's getting, getting service. All right, so right now we're gonna play some ambient hospital sounds, um, just stuff that you would hear in a normal hospital, background noise, and we'll see if that stirs anything up. And we'll go from there. Oh, good. Hold that for a second. So we'll let that run for another 15 seconds or so. Yeah. And then pause it, and I'm just going to roll on the DR60. Right. Super no questions. Unique. Just going to let it run. See if we can pick up any you know, residual energy or anything reacting to these noises. Right. And then we'll do like a flat line to see if we get a different response. All right. See how the vibe changes. All right. So do it for like another. Ten five, seconds. five, ten seconds, yeah. Don't let me know when you're about to pause it. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. Another noise down there. It was like a knock. Yeah. On the, on the stairs. Literally, it's like a knock right there. Yeah. All right, let's play this back, see if we got anything from that. Right from the beginning. Yeah. Hey. Hey, get. That was me there at the end, but. Yeah. So it was like a hey, and then there was like get the, and then there's something, something, but it can't pick it up. Right. Now let's try a different one. Let's try the flat line. Yeah. And, uh, See if that changes. See if we get a different reaction. You hold the recorder this time. Do this yeah. one. And uh, all right, we're gonna play a flat line sound this time, which will be great. It's always a lot of fun. All right. Let's see. All right, so we're gonna play um, like a heartbeat monitor, hospital monitor with a flat line. So let's see if that kind of stirs up any sort of reaction from the staff. I mean, this was staff housing for most of the time, so we'll see if they start reacting to that. Right. Ready? Because again, this is something that they would have heard. Yeah. They would have heard this in their day-to-day -day jobs and all these other buildings. Even in training. Right, yeah. exactly, exactly. They would have had to read um, these type of you know, charts and these type of monitors and stuff like that. So we'll let this go like this for a minute and then it's gonna flatline like somebody's passing away and uh, see if that creates a rush or anything like that of them trying to get to, here we go. Nurse, help! Can we get some help? Someone's coding. We need help. It was right behind you. It was right behind you. was right behind you. That was in this room. Yeah. That was in this room directly behind me. I think my heart stopped for a second. Yeah. Uh, same as this. <laughs> Holy crap. That was literally. Who was that even on? I don't know. It sounded like metallic. It tapped on the, either this cabinet. Yeah. Like. I don't know. I don't know what that hit, but it was in this room. Close, probably the door is what it sounded like. Oh, mm, good. Oh. That was right behind me. Yeah, that directly was... behind me. They're getting comfortable. 
Well, I'm not. <laughs> All right. All right. Let's, Let's see if we get anything. It's whispering. Put that back. Chatter. chatter again. That's so weird. That noise was directly behind me, though. Like, literally yeah. right behind me. Right behind loud. me. Um, all right. Um, I don't know. Again, more knocks, bangs, stuff on the door. All around us. Everywhere. Footsteps. The humming, like that humming we heard? Yeah. I don't know. This place it's is weird. weird. Yeah. This building is odd. Um, why don't we move up? We'll go up to the third floor. Mm -hmm. We'll do a bunch of EVPs, really try to make contact, get some clear answers, get some actual sentences, voices, something like that. And then it's time for solos. That'll be so fun. I can't wait. All right, let's do it. Let's go. Really quick, guys, if you're enjoying this video, make sure you drop down below, give us a thumbs up. If we get 3,000 likes in this video, we're gonna go to Trans-Allegheny Lunatic Asylum in West Virginia. Now let's get back into it. All right guys, now we're up on the third floor. Again, it looks exactly the same, but we went up a floor. We're gonna be doing strictly EVPs up here. We're gonna try to make contact with whoever's been humming, slamming doors, running up the stairs. Um, so hopefully we can get some solid answers before we go do our solos, which is gonna be really fun. But I'm excited to see what we get. All right, so I think we jump right in with questions, right? Yeah. See if we can figure out- Who's who, slamming the doors? And who we've been talking to? Yeah. Or who has been talking at least? Yeah. Ready? Couple questions each? Yeah. Let's do it. One, two, three. Is there a nurse on staff right now working? Can you tell us what month it is? Are we not supposed to be up here? You just touch me. One, two, three. You get touched? Yeah. Um, um, I thought I like bumped into something, but there's, there's nothing, nothing there. on the wall. No, there's nothing there. Um, it literally felt like someone like grabbed my butt, which is weird. I, that's I, new. A <laughs> touch touch. Yeah. Nice. That's bizarre. A but, gift. Yeah. Sure. It's a double caked up on a Tuesday. <laughs> Been hitting legs, I see. <laughs> Check this out. Thanks. Huh. That's bizarre. I don't think I've ever had that happen. Wasn't well, me. <laughs> <laughs> I thought so I like bumped into something, though. That's what I was looking for. Yeah, there's me. nothing there. That's too bad. Huh. Hmm. All right. Hey, cool. gift. They said, we're going to cop a few real quick. <laughs> Check Just this out. Squeeze on by here. Yikes. Literally squeeze on by. Yikes. All right, let's see if they commented on that. Yeah. I almost died. Hmm. Is there a nurse on staff right now working? Can you tell us what month it is? It's April? I'm going to play that one more time. I can't tell what that's that. Yeah. Alright, 
players. That's weird. Demo sounds like it says it's April though. Yeah. It's April. Which it turns out it is. Yeah. And I have to wear a beanie. It's cold out. What's going on? It's like 36 degrees right now, guys. It's cold. Yeah. Underestimated the coldness. I have a hoodie on. Yeah. Burr. You'd think I'd know by now. Good thing this place has a lot of windows. Hmm. Yikes. Say it again. It sounds like some whispers. It's, it's April. Yeah. Can you tell us what month it is? It's April. Yeah. Try that again. I don't know what that says. I thought I heard the word kids in there, but I couldn't make out like anything else around it. No. Weird. Super, super weird. Bizarre. Let's do a couple more. Yeah. Um, yeah. It's weird again. Yeah. And this is just a weird building. This is a whole weird facility. This whole yeah. com com complex is just bizarre. Yeah. And uncomfortable. Yeah. Yikes. All right. And we still have solos to do. Yay. I thought so we fun. did the Alone series already. But yeah. you guys like it, so apparently, because you guys like it, you like to see us torture ourselves and be put in bad situations, we'll do it. Yeah. Just, just, for you guys. just for you guys. It's all for you. You're welcome. All right. Let's, uh, let's walk down this way a little bit. By room 113 and 114. Hmm. Okay. A yep. couple questions. All right. A couple questions. Yeah. Ready? Mm -hmm. One. That bird's nest just scared the <laughs> hell out of me. Is that the bird? Is there a bird in there? Oh, yeah. I think so. I think it's empty. What's above it? Oh, it's like a fixture? I thought I was like sitting up there. Okay. I don't know. That'd be funny though. All right, no bird. No bird. We're safe. Scare the shit out of me. I'll look for my eye. All right, ready? Yeah. One, two, three. Can you tell us what number is on either one of these doors right here behind Dylan? Do you like having visitors, having people come in here and talk to you? Can you see what color my backpack is? What color is that? I'm gonna ask one more time. Did you touch me a minute ago? What floor should I go to alone? How are you treated here?
Camera heavy? Yeah. <laughs> These cameras are heavy. <laughs> Here we go. Right at the beginning, what? That's all that says. One fourteen. That one probably not. Eleven fourteen. It's like I can't. Yeah, I can't quite make it out. There's something. Yes, I, I did. did. I heard yes, that. I did. That's yes, so clear. I did. Wow, I hate that. What? what? That's like four or five words. Mm -hmm. Go, go, to, go to the. It's like. I can't tell. I can't tell. That was weird. It's like yes, I did. That was clear too. All right. Well, I wow. think I know what floor you're doing yourself. Yeah. Over. Sick. Thanks. Uh -huh. They grabbed your butt. That was weird. I said, cop on a field. <laughs> Check this out. Squats for Sally, huh? Yeah. Sick. All right. Let's see what, if I got anything similar on this one. Can you tell us what number is on either one of these doors right here? Behind the door? What? It was a whisper. Yeah. Though. I was like, <laughs> yeah. Do that one more time. Can you tell us what number is on either one of these doors right here? Behind the door? Please, it's like, please stop. Can you make it out? Do you like having visitors? Having people come in here and talk to you? What? what? Oh, yeah, yeah. Do you like having visitors? Having people come in here and talk to you? Yes, I do. It's, it's like, like yes, yes, I do. One time. Do you like having visitors? Having people come in here and talk to you? Who's coming up the stairs? What was that? Oh, almost died. <laughs> All right, just keep playing. Let's let's finish yeah. this. Can you tell us what number is on either one of these doors right here? Behind the door? Do you like having visitors? Having people come in here and talk to you? That's so weird. I just don't. Can you see what color my backpack is? What color is that? I can't tell what that says either. There's two words. It's garbled, yeah. I'm going to ask one more time. Did you touch me a minute ago? Nothing super clear on that one either. No. What a 
weird build, like weird building overall, right? Yeah. Like a lot of stuff going on all around us from voices, footsteps, voices, bangs, knocks, being touched. Yeah, you got your butt grabbed. That was weird. A gift. A gift. Thanks. Strange. Return strange, to center. Strange, 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 strange place. I really don't know what to make of this place. No. It's active. It's haunted. It's scary. They're intelligent. There's definitely an intelligence here. Um, I think they move from building to building. Absolutely. I definitely think they move throughout the buildings, as we heard somebody run up the stairs. Yeah, unfortunately. Um, but I, I definitely think they moved throughout the buildings because that little girl definitely followed us mm -hmm. um, throughout Lippet at least, and she's been seen in other places. Right. So I don't know about this place. It freaks me out. I'm not yeah. looking forward to this solo. I didn't love our last solo in Lippet. Mm -mm. Um, nope. This one's not going to be any more fun because we heard the running up the stairs, which is unfortunate. Awful. Yeah. So, um, but I think it's about that time. I know you're going to be up here. That's mm. going to be your spot. Lucky you. Lovely. And, uh, We'll go from here and we'll go do our solos and then we'll call it a wrap on Norwich. Let's do it. Let's go. All right, guys, if you've been enjoying the investigation here tonight at the nurse's dorm of Norwich State Hospital, do not forget, drop down, hit that subscribe button, turn on the notification bell so you are notified every single week when we upload brand new videos every Monday night, 8.33 p.m. Eastern. We've been going to some of the most haunted locations in the entire U.S., so you're not gonna wanna miss them. Hit that subscribe button. Now let's get into these solos. All right, guys, it is time for our solos. Inside the nurse's dorm here at Norwich State Hospital, which I'm really not looking forward to, Dylan is going to stay up here on the third floor where he got his butt grabbed. Go, Dylan. Sick. I'm gonna go back down to the first floor where we heard the running, the door slamming, the voices, all that good stuff. It's been a good night. The music box went off, the MF rope. Great. Yeah. So Great I'm gonna times. go down there. Uh, you stay up here. You have the Melmeter and the MF rope. Yeah. I have the REM pod and the music box. Both have DR60s. So we're gonna go do some solos and uh, this will be it for Norwich and that'll be a wrap. Good luck up here. Catch you on the other side. Have fun. I'll see if I can fall down the stairs. <laughs> yeah, it's a little dark in here, guys. Again, if you forgot, just in case you forgot, this is how dark it is. So you got a little ambient light with the EMF rope right there. Turn around this way. That's the Mel all the way down there. So that's cool. All right, guys. Here we go. First floor. Which, oh, by the way. Is the darkest because it's completely boarded up. So lucky me. So I'm up here alone now. Hashtag alone. Can you set off one of these devices I have set up? Either this rope light here on the ground. If you walk near it. Mel at the end is going off. I don't know if you can hear it. I'm gonna go down here where we were earlier. I'm gonna set up the REM pod and the music box. See what we can get. Also probably gonna do some DR60 sessions up here. See if maybe they're a little more talkative now that I'm alone. Grab my butt, which is pretty weird. I've never had that happen before. So chalk that up to a first for Norwich here. So there's that. It's not there. And put the music box. That's a joke. Can you touch that again? I didn't even get to put the music box up yet. If that's you, can you touch that again for me? It just lets me know you're here. Ready, three, two, one. Are you excited that I'm up here alone?
Did you follow us from the Lippet building? So what I was going to do is I'm going to set the music box up down here where we had it before and see if we can get it to go off again. I'm also going to do some DR60 sessions. Were you the one that touched me? Yo, I swear, it literally felt like someone just smacked my phone. My phone's in my front pocket right here. I swear to God, it felt like someone just smacked my phone. I don't know if you heard it. It made an audible noise. That was bizarre, dude. This place is touchy. I do not like it up here. Dude, I almost never get touched. I've been touched twice here in this one building. So if there's somebody down here with me, can you touch that red light on the floor? Or step in front of this device here. It'll play music. What is going on up here, dude? All right, I'm gonna play this back. See if we got anything here. What? I can't tell what it's saying. Have I mentioned I don't love this place? It's very freaky. Um, it's pitch black always on this floor. The REM pod already went off once, which was bizarre because it hasn't gone off at all tonight. Uh, so that was kind of crazy. Music box is right here, it hasn't gone off yet, but I think I'm gonna do some DR60 sessions. Jump in and see if we can talk to some people. After Steve and I wrap up doing our solos here, we're gonna leave for the night. We're gonna leave Norwich. We're gonna head home. We're gonna be out of your hair, okay? So what I ask right now is that you interact with us. Whoever you enjoy talking to more, interact with our equipment, answer our questions on the DR60s, just so we can have some solid answers, so we can tell your story. Here we go. How many people are in this hallway with me right now? Did I just hear you? Three, two, one. Can you tell me your name? Are you coming in this building? Are you just getting to work? One, two, three. I heard a voice down there, and then I heard walking over here, which is towards the door, the entrance over that way. Let's play this back and see what we got. Did you just move in that hallway down there? How many people are in this hallway with me right now? Did I just hear you? Let's say get him. Nothing super clear on those other questions, but it definitely sounded like I said, get them, which isn't great. So uh, please don't get me. Unless you're talking about Dylan. If you're talking about Dylan, that's fine. Get him, but me, 
leave me alone. I'm pretty cool. All right, let's do another one. Let's do a couple more questions. What makes you happy? Were you treated well here? Were they nice to you? I think I'm gonna walk down here a little bit to do a couple more questions. I just don't wanna go in front of the music box too much. So I'm gonna go right here. Actually, I'm gonna do a silent one. Let's give them the floor. Let's give them the floor right now. Anybody on this floor? If there's anybody on this floor right now, I'm not gonna talk. This is your chance. Say whatever you wanna say to me right into this device in my hand. You come up to it, speak into it, I'll be able to hear you. Completely on you right now. I'm not gonna ask any questions, it's all up to you. One, two, three. One, two, three. Can you tell me your name or what you'd like to be addressed by? That was kind of bizarre. That ended right as I ended my DR60 session. All right, let's play that silent one back and see if we got anything. See if they said anything during their time. Right off the beginning there. Oh, great. This has been a really, really weird night. Play this back though, real quick. Can you tell me your name? Right at the beginning, hold on. Can you tell me your name? Kid? Can you Kid. tell me your name? Did you just move in that hallway down there? That was, that was a whisper, that was a human whisper. Did you just move in that hallway? Dude. Can you tell me your name? Did you just move in that hallway down there? That was me, that's crazy. What? Can you tell me your name or what you'd like to be addressed by? Dude. 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 Yo. So I give them the floor, let them say whatever they want to say, and they, that's what they say. Let's, you want to play that again? That's, that's what you choose to say? I give you the floor to say whatever you want, and you do that? Seems kind of weird. Let's play that again so you can hear it. That actually sounds like it says get out right at the beginning. Get out. Okay, so screaming. I don't know what that was. Dude, did you hear that? That was so loud. This, uh, is this the staircase? It sounded like someone just like either stomped their foot or... Dude, that was so loud. 
Did you just scream? Did you just yell? If that was you yelling, can you send off one of these devices I have? Either this one down here or the one on the ground right here that you just stepped in front of that plays music? I don't know what that was. Dude, did you hear that? That was so loud. This, uh, is this the staircase? It sounded like someone just like either stomped their foot or... Dude, that was so loud. This hallway sucks. This hallway really sucks. If you're down in this hall with me, can you make a noise? Knock on one of these doors? I just want to know that you're here. Can you step away, please? So the stops. I'm gonna walk down towards it a little bit, I think. Were you a patient here? Can you set off that device if you were a patient? Whatever you can do to let me know that you're here. Knock, walk around, say something. That sounded like a footstep right next to me. Or if you were a doctor, I say doctor and it goes off. So just to confirm, if you were a doctor at this facility, can you step away so that device stops? So you were a patient? If you were a patient, step away so the device stops. I understand it's probably difficult. It's probably very confusing. But we want to interact with you. We want to ask you these questions and figure out this place's history. A lot of it is unknown. A lot of records were lost or covered up. So just to confirm, can you step away for a second so I can ask you a question? Birds are up, guys. <laughs> yeah, they are. Can you step back so I can ask you a question, please? That literally sounded like a footstep, like right here. Like literally right here. That sounded like somebody just walked in that door and came right here. I don't know what that means. All right, I'm going to turn this off. I don't know what that means. I couldn't even get a full sentence out. I do not feel alone down here. What a, what a crazy night. Let's do, uh, let's do another session. Let's do another EP session, ask some more questions. Whew. All right, let's do, uh, let's do at least one more, maybe, maybe two more, but let's do, uh, let's do another one right now. We've been here for a long time. Are you ready for us to leave or do you want us to stay? I'm going to do another DR60 session, hopefully get some more solid answers as to what's going on here. And uh, wrap up the night here at Norwich. 
Ready? Three, two, one. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. Can you say the name of this facility, what you know it as? Can you tell us who was humming, making noises all around us throughout the night? And that wasn't Dylan. That was not Dylan. That was on this floor. That was on this floor. Can you say the name of this facility, what you know it as? Can you tell us who was humming, making noises all around us throughout the night? I don't even know what that was. That was so loud. I'm going to play back that one question, I guess. I said, are you ready for us to leave or do you want us to stay? And it made that super loud bang, so. I say get out. Get out. And then there was that, it says get out and then there was that super loud bang. Literally, I say, do you want us to leave or do you want us to stay? It says get out and that super loud bang. All right, I'll play back whatever we got in that little segment. And then I'll do, I'll probably do one more. See if I can get him to say good night or goodbye, you know? Let's see. Can you say the name of the facility? What you know it as? Maybe? What? Can you tell us who was humming? Making noises all around us throughout the night? Me. It's, a, it's like it says it multiple times. Do I even do the usual, can you say goodnight? I don't think they want to say goodnight to us. But I'm going to do it. Last one, guys. This is the last EVP session, and then we're done. I'm, ha I'm done. We're heading out. I'm all set with Norwich. Catch you next time. But uh, we're gonna do one more EVP session. That will go meet up with Dylan. Here we go. I'm gonna do one more session. See if I can get him to say good night, goodbye, anything of the sort. I'm gonna make sure one more time my alarm's not gonna go off. And wrap up our uh, investigation here at Norwich State Hospital. It's been an insane night. Absolutely insane. All right, here we go. Three. Two, one. All right, we're about to head out for the night. We appreciate you talking with us, interacting with us, setting off our devices. One final ask. 
Can you say good night or goodbye for me? One, two, three. There was just another noise down there. We got it. All right, I'm going to do this quick and then we're getting out of here. They want us to go. They want us to leave now. My device, it literally just shut off. Did you hear it click? I was literally mid-recording and it just shut off. That was weird. I don't think I've ever had a DR60 shut off in front of me. All right, well, let's see. What? Play that back one more time. We know? We appreciate you talking with us, interacting with us, setting off our devices. One final ask. Can you say good night? That's all they recorded? What? They're done with us. They don't want to talk to us anymore. I'm going to do one more session and then we're getting out. One, two, three. Okay, we're leaving. We're not going to bother you anymore. Can you say good night or goodbye? I'm going to try one more time. Three, two, one. Did you just turn off my recorder? Again, we appreciate you talking to us, interacting with us throughout the night in both Lippet and the nurses building. Can you say good night or goodbye? One, two, three. Maybe they were nice and said good night or goodbye, but they want us out. I can't tell. I'm going to play that one more time. I can't tell what it says. Okay, we're leaving. We're not going to bother you anymore. Can you say goodnight or goodbye? It almost sounds like it says goodnight, but I'm not sure. It's not super clear. I'm going to play this back real quick. See what's going on. See if I got some answers. Did you just turn off my recorder? What? I did, and then something. What? I did something. I don't know what it's saying. I did. I was done. Good night, dude, there it is. Dude, it said both. I'm gonna play it again. It was like two different voices. That was cool. That was really, really cool. It was like a whisper said goodnight and then a deeper, louder voice said goodbye. That was really, really neat actually. Um, and the fact they turned off my recorder. All right, guys. That was me. All right, guys. I think that's it. I think we're gonna call it a night here at Norwich. We've bothered them long enough. They're sick of us. I'm done with Norwich. I've had enough of it for tonight. Sun's coming up, birds are chirping. It's time to go. That's a wrap, guys. I'm gonna go meet up with Dylan. That's a wrap on Norwich. Let's get out of here. I, I have full body chills. I swear to God.
I just saw a foot come out of that room right there. I thought someone was about to walk out of that room. Oh my God, that was actually really scary. Dude, it's broad daylight. Well, not quite broad daylight, but the sun's coming up. How did that just happen? I literally saw a full foot. It looked like a boot. Oh, wow, all right. That's a good send off though. Good night, goodbye. And it's like they're about to come out to walk me out. Thanks. Um, I'm gonna head downstairs, meet up with Steve, and uh, get heading home. All right, guys, as you can hear, the birds are out, the sun is up, so that means we have survived another set of alone challenges. Norwich State Hospital has been conquered, but it was a crazy night. I mean, both buildings were incredibly active. Yeah, it was almost like doing two separate investigations yeah. in one night. Obviously, last week's video was Lippet, which is where we started out tonight. Um, really intelligent, intense activity over there. And then we came over here to the nurses' building, which has a whole different kind of vibe. It's, it's dark, it's intense. You're never comfortable. You always feel anxious in here. And again, like some of the loudest footsteps, the voices, the bangs, the doors. I mean, some of the stuff that was going on here really surprised me and it made me uncomfortable at certain points. Absolutely, it was intelligent too. There's a lot of intelligence, direct responses, devices going off, being touched, seeing things. It was crazy. Um, I think we need to take a break from this spot though. It's a little scary. Yeah, I think we're good at Norwich for a while. There are more buildings here, so we will have to come back at some point to hit those other spots, but we'll take a break. We'll head some other spots, but you guys, I'm telling you, you're not gonna miss what's coming up next week. You've been waiting for it. We've done it once before. We did lose some of the footage when we got robbed, but guys, next week, Winchester Mystery House is finally here on the channel, Monday night, 8.33 p.m. Eastern. We'll see you guys there. You do not wanna miss it. Let's get to it and uh, we'll see you next week.